Oh. She down there cooking some damn spam. No, it's just mysterious. I like barbecue sauce. Hey everyone, it's Micah Fragrance back at it again with another video. Today is a very special video. I'm going to be reviewing my favorite niche fragrance in my collection, and that is Mancera's Tonka Cola. So in this video, I'll be going over price, longevity and projection, the note breakdown, what I actually smell, the occasions it would be good for, and then obviously if I think you should get it or not. I think the first thing we should just get into should be the note breakdown and what I actually smell. With the name Tonka Cola, you're expecting a Tonka and Coca-Cola heavy fragrance, and it definitely does have those two notes that are very apparent. There's a lot more to it. So top notes, cinnamon, cherry, Sicilian lemon, and nutmeg. Uh, middle notes, Coca-Cola, Indonesian patchouli leaf, and orange blossom. Base notes of Tonka bean, vanilla, benzoin, and labdanum. So when you first spray this fragrance, I have it sprayed on my wrist. It's very citrusy, um, really good, and that's pretty much all I get. All I get is that Sicilian lemon. It straight up reminds me of these uh, lemon drop candies. Super, super good. Those are a go-to candy, by the way, but if you guys know how those smell or taste, straight up what the opening on this smells like, let's get an, an atomizer test, and let's do another spray. Let's just do it on the other side. Really good. Pressurized atomizer. Ooh, absolutely beautiful. I kind of got in my eye. Yeah, but smelling it, it's this super nice... Right off the opening, super nice, fresh, kind of almost sour to the nose lemon. Not a, like a cleaning product sour way. Not uh, not like some of these Creed Aventus clones that tend to have like a really like lemon heavy opening. This is a really nice, authentic lemon. Really, really good. And after it's been dried down for a little bit, you definitely do get a little bit of that cinnamon. Maybe a tad bit of that cherry. But after it dries down for about an hour or two, that Coca-Cola becomes really apparent. That uh, Tonka bean definitely comes apparent. And with this fragrance... It doesn't just straight up smell like a Coca-Cola. I know that this fragrance had a lot of hype and people were like, if you want to just smell like a Coca-Cola, get this fragrance. There's a lot more to it. It's a citrus, fizzy cola. As soon as you spray it on to when you can't smell it anymore, it always has that fizziness, which definitely does add to that cola vibe. But it's a really good fragrance. What do I actually smell? I just said it. Cinnamon, cola, cherry, um, Tonka scent. Really, really good citrusy as well, but I highly recommend this one just based off the scent alone. Let's go on to longevity and projection. So this fragrance is really good. I get eight plus hours of longevity. I'm not completely sure. All I know is at that eight hour mark, I could still definitely smell it. With this fragrance, I'm actually going to say probably like 10 plus hours of longevity. It's a pretty strong fragrance. Longevity, or sorry, projection, about three to four feet for the first couple hours. Um, and then obviously goes down. This is a really good projecting fragrance as well. It kind of does have this powdery side, which I forgot to say. Um, it definitely does have this powdery side. And a lot of people said that it smelled old. Now, when I wore this fragrance to school, I showed a lot of people it and was just trying to get their opinions. Half the people said it smelled amazing. Half the people said it kind of smelled old. So it definitely does have this kind of like old school, hippie, non-champa incense vibe. Uh, a little bit powdery too as well. But this is just an absolutely beautiful fragrance in my opinion. Um, but a really good, long-lasting, strong fragrance. Let's get to the price on this one. So the cheapest I've seen this fragrance, about like $95 to $100. So it's not that bad. I ended up picking this fragrance up for $120. I was shopping on Amazon, had some money on my card. And I was like, you know what? I've always wanted Mancera's Tonka Cola. Let's just get it. Really happy I did get it, but you can get it a little bit cheaper, around that $100 mark. I think even at that $120 mark, it's worth it. Even at its retail price of $180 for the four ounce, I still think it's worth it. Like This is an absolutely beautiful and phenomenal fragrance. Let's start wrapping up this video. And the last thing I'm going to talk about is the occasions that you should wear, and then if I would recommend it to you. So this is a really good fragrance occasion-wise. It's going to be great in that cooler weather. Dress this one up. I wouldn't really recommend dressing this down, although I do dress it down, you know, if I wear it to school. Um, but this is going to be better, you know, dressed up, go to going to a nice dinner, maybe go to a wedding or something like that. You can also wear this in the warm weather as well. Now, obviously, don't go heavy on that sprays because it still is, you know, a warmer weather fragrance. But it's this really nice, just citrus, cola, fizzy vibe in the heat definitely when it is cooler you definitely do get a little more of like those spices but in the heat when i had worn this fragrance it was just this really nice fizzy citrus cola type scent and it was just a really good fragrance now would i recommend this one to you i would 100 percent recommend mancera's tonka cola to any of you guys looking just to try out a fragrance that might not be you know a usual fragrance to you if you want to try out something that's different mancera's tonka cola is different but still definitely good. So let me know in the comments below if you guys have tried Mancera's Tonka Cola, if you think you might try it, 
If not, what's a what's your favorite Mancera? If you've never smelled Mancera, what's your favorite niche fragrance in general? Just let me know in the comments below. But obviously, thoughts on Tonka Cola if you guys have tried it. Thank you all for watching. Have a great day. Make sure to like and subscribe for new videos. Peace, everyone. I love you all.